DDS were awarded the project by Martello Building Consultancy to demolish the former Onyx nightclub and two bridges in Folkestone. These were located over the disused railway line on the seafront. Over the coming years, there will be a significant transformation in this entire area. These two sites are the side of the railway, are the first sort of opening phases of the whole development, which is um, around 900 residential units, shops uh, and, um, and commercial premises that will be built along the harbour front. With this demolition being the very beginning. The nightclub was the first structure to be raised. We then moved onto bridge number one, a steel-framed, reinforced concrete structure. The first action was to remove the main span canopy by hand. Next, we craned down the two steel-framed end canopies. Props were installed and we began the demolition of the main span by breaking the concrete and cutting the steel and rebar. Once separated at either end of the bridge span, we used a 350 ton crane to lift the main span in a single lift. After the main span was carefully lifted over and above the track and platform, it was placed down in the landing area to be processed. Here, we broke the section down into smaller pieces to be processed through the crusher, down to a 6F2 grade. We left this on site for the client to reuse. The demolition of bridge number two followed straight after. This was a sectional concrete bridge in poor condition so we had many considerations in how to safely demolish the structure. The platform was listed, therefore it was necessary to install a dual purpose crash deck and working platform across the tracks. The crash deck protected the listed platform, which meant the working platform was then sufficient to take the weight of a 25 ton machine in order to gain better access to the bridge. To do this, we needed to create an access point. The 25 ton machine was tracked along the beach facing wall to the furthest point, whereby we demolished a suitable section through to the platform. Once access was created, we began the demolition by pulverizing the bridge using a hydraulic attachment. The crash deck effectively served its purpose to safely contain the concrete debris as the bridge was carefully raised. The project was completed successfully, safely and on time. <laughs>